Hello and welcome to this webinar on the updates to the Mango app. This video will describe how to use the app, including the new features released in version 2. Firstly, if you haven't already, go to the App Store or Google Play Store and download the Mango app. The best way to find this is to search for Mango QHSE. You'll also need to ensure that your Mango administrator has enabled you to access the app. The Mango app will allow you to report issues using simplified forms and respond to issues assigned to you to investigate. From your device, select the app icon, enter your normal login details here, and select sign in. Your phone will then ask you to set up a passcode. This code will be used going forward to access the app. Confirm the passcode and you'll see the dashboard. The modules that display here will depend on what your normal access rights are. We'll walk through the modules, starting with Accident Incidents. To report an incident, select the Add button, complete the details, and save. This will then display a screen confirming that you have successfully reported an incident, and will send the normal notifications to the coordinator. To respond to an incident that has been assigned to you to investigate, select the relevant record. The details will display on screen and the history or action details can be viewed by selecting the action details tab. By selecting the button at the top, you can add a comment, take a photo and attach it, choose an existing photo on your device to upload and complete the investigation. Audit module. Within the audit module, you can add a new audit. To do this, select audit, select the add button, then select the template you're wanting to use, complete the scope details, select the reviewer, and save. This will then display the audit ready to be completed. To complete an audit that has been assigned to you, select the relevant audit, Select the tab labelled Form. Expand the section. Select your responses. By selecting the button next to the question, you can add a note, raise an improvement, take a photo, and choose an existing photo on your device to upload. These photos will now display as images within the audit. To complete the audit, Select the button at the top of the screen and select Sign Off. Event Module. To sign off on an event that has been assigned to you, select the relevant event. Select Sign Off. Enter the date completed. Tick the Use Finish date if the next event is to recalculate based on when this one was completed. Complete the details. Attach any photos as evidence by either taking a photo or choose an existing photo on your device to upload and save. Improvement module. To report an improvement, select the Add button, complete the details and save. This will then display a screen confirming that you have successfully reported an improvement and will send the normal notifications to the coordinator. To respond to an improvement that has been assigned to you to investigate, select the relevant record. The details will display on screen and the history or action details can be viewed by selecting the action details tab. By selecting the button at the top, you can add a comment, take a photo to attach, choose an existing photo on your device to upload and complete the investigation. Plant and Equipment module. This module can be used to enter usage data against an item of equipment. Select Plant and Equipment. Find the item that you want to add data to by either starting to type the name of the equipment into the search or by scanning the QR code for the equipment. The QR code can be found in Manage Plant Equipment on the desktop. Enter current readings or units used. 
complete the details and save. This data will display in the History tab for the item in the web app or desktop. Risk Management module. Select Risk. To report a risk, select the Add button. Select the template to use. Complete the details. Take a photo to attach or select a photo already on your device to upload and save. This will then display a screen confirming that you have successfully reported a risk and will send the normal notifications to the coordinator. To respond to a risk that has been assigned to you to investigate, select the relevant record. The details will display on screen and the history action details can be viewed by selecting the action details tab. By selecting the button at the top, you can add a comment, take a photo to attach, choose an existing photo on your device to upload, and complete the investigation. And that's a walkthrough of the Mango app. Hopefully you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching.